Hey guys, welcome to another technology tutorial by the Magic Monk. Today we're going to start teaching you guys a bit of JavaScript, which is a very important language if you're into web development or if you're going to perhaps develop mobile phone apps in the future. So you have to learn this language pretty much sooner or later if you're interested in all of that. Okay, so let's get started by getting you guys to download a very important program called Notepad++. Okay, the reason for that is because we're going to need some kind of program to edit all of our code. And uh, the Windows Notepad doesn't have some of the functionalities that will make coding a lot easier. So download this program, install it on your computer, then come back when you're done. Okay, so as you can see, I now have Notepad++ running on the screen. And the next thing I want to do is go into your computer uh, file explorer or whatever you call it and create a folder that you're going to use on your hard drive to store all of your web pages. As you can see right now I have a folder inside my C drive. Um, this is just within my documents. I have a folder called Magic Monk Tutorials Websites and then I have a JavaScript folder that I'm going to store all the files that I'm creating for you guys and I'm also going to upload these onto the internet later so you can uh, have a look at what we have done if you wish. Okay, so once you have a folder created for JavaScript, I want you to right click inside the folder and then click on new and then click on text document. And what this does is it creates a new file and we're going to call this file index.html. So that's the full file name. So create that. Uh, click yes when it comes up with this message and now we have a blank web page inside our JavaScript folder that I'm going to drag to our notepad++ program so I'll just drag it in and now it's open within notepad++ okay so now let's do the first bit of coding with JavaScript and the first thing you need is to declare this page as an HTML file. So if you haven't done our HTML tutorials, you should probably do that first before JavaScript. So right now this page is an HTML file and we're going to declare where the body of the page is. So within between this body and the slash body tag is our page contents. And on our page, I'm going to declare a section where we put in our JavaScript. So within script and slash script, within the space is where we can put in our JavaScript code. And the first code that I'm going to teach you is how to write something onto the screen. And the code for that is simply document dot right and I'm gonna teach you guys about uh, more commands later but right now we'll just um, use some basic commands and you'll see a pattern pretty soon so document dot right bracket un, uh, quotation mark hello from JavaScript Okay, and finish the quotation mark, finish the brackets, and you need a semicolon at the end, okay, because that's how JavaScript works. Okay, so you're going to save this document, and then what you're going to do is right click on your HTML file, and then choose open with uh, Firefox, or Chrome, or whatever browser that you use normally so I might just open it up with Chrome and you can see right now it has my 
web page open that says hello from JavaScript. Okay, so you're going to set up your editing environment with this screen, the Notepad++ on the left and the web browser on the right. So whatever changes you make on the left, you can just refresh your page on the right and you can see the changes. So if I copy this line of code and I write in the second line, hello again from JavaScript. And if I save it by pressing Control S and I refresh it on the right hand side, it shows up straight away. Okay, and we'll teach you guys more about this stuff later. So, I uh, hope you enjoy the first tutorial. See you next time.